right, so making a little bit more progress on this cage. Haven't filmed a whole lot. It's just a lot of cutting and grinding and fitting and in and out and grunting and fun stuff. But <clears throat> starting to actually make some sense out of it now. Got the door bars fitted. I do got to trim those a little bit. But I also did get the rear bars in, which is actually pretty sweet. So these are all just test fitted in there. Some are tacked in. The rear down bars are actually just kind of resting in there. And they hold themselves in there pretty well. I did go under the window, so you can't see them coming out. So that was kind of my main goal, was I didn't want to be able to see anything coming out the rear window. I uh, just wanted to be able to run the tonneau cover like that. I'm not sure if it's completely like 850 cert legal. Uh, the rear bars are at a 38 degree angle. And they do come through just like this. And then go through the bed and they'll be welded onto the frame there. So when I say 38, I mean 38 degrees from vertical. So if I put the uh, angle finder on it, it actually reads 52 like this. But it's 38 degrees from vertical. So, so there's kind of the fitment around the front bar. These are just tacked into place here. And again, I just have everything kind of rested in there balancing now. I'll probably end up taking the seatbelt out or the, at least the driver's side. That one will fit back up a little bit better, but probably a little bit more trimming around there. And I do like how the angled, or how the bars come down. It's at a pretty decent angle, I think. So should work pretty well. Definitely give me a little bit more safety than what it was before. So as I said before, I want to... These welds are broken right now, so then I want to tip this whole front section back. So then I can weld around the backside here, and I'll probably have to get a little creative on some of the other ones. This whole rear section, I might be able to tip forward and get it to pivot down through the floor enough that I can actually weld the tops all the way around. But I, I might actually have a room. I might actually have enough room to get around the backside there. So one that will definitely be tricky though is this section here because the panels are pretty tight. I did get uh, like a swivel torch. Uh, swivel head for the TIG torch. So hopefully that will help me out a little bit. Yeah, that's it for this one. Quick update. Uh, I definitely found something that I don't really enjoy doing, and that's putting in roll cages. I mean, I like a lot of stuff. Building stuff and wiring and all kinds of things that don't really make sense sometimes. But this one I'm not really having a whole lot of fun with. So it's coming together, but I'll definitely be glad when it's over.